Now that we are done with arching the wall, we can move on to placing furnitures into our room and also placing the sanitary equipment into our toilets and kitchen. So we'll go back to our block reference and copy some block from the block reference and we'll put them into position in our drawing. So let's go to block reference and there's this particular block here that I've mapped out already. So we just copy everything. It's, it has everything we we'll need for our drawing. So select everything and do Ctrl C. Go back to your floor plan and do Ctrl V. And let's just put it somewhere around here. So what we we'll now do is we we'll start by copying the furniture into the ante room and to the living room and bedroom and to the rest of the rooms we have here now. So, so let's copy some more chairs into the into the block reference. Let's copy this. Ctrl C, and we'll take it back to our floor plan, and do Ctrl V here. So. Most of them are not grouped together, so let's group them together so that it will be easy for us to use in our drawing. So let's copy this in particular into our anti room rotate it a bit And copy. You can have something like this around here. And let's kind of place a TV around here. This is our TV set. So let's group all this together again. And click on copy again. We'll rotate it again. And let's place it into the ante room. So it's kind of looking bigger than the ante room. So what we're going to do is scale it down a bit. Use the scale command. And do something like point seven, and we can now copy again. Let's see how it looks now. So it's looking better now. It's looking better now. So we can populate the living room too. Let's just copy all of this and this and place them here. Hit the escape key. And before we go for one thing we should pay attention to is that all these things they have their layers they are on. So click on this and look at the layer they are they are on furniture layer. So Let's check the rest again and check the layer they're on. This is on sanitary layer. The wash and business sanitary layer. 
the shower tray is furniture layer. I think all those are good. The bedroom should be on furniture. The layers they are on are okay for us, so we can continue. So let me pick this center table here and drop it in the middle of the living room. Let me drop it somewhere around here. So I'll copy this TV here, but I have to rotate it to fit the orientation I want. And now I'm done with the living room. So we can move to the bedroom, this bedroom here. And let's just drop this bed there. Somewhere around there. The bedroom here, let's drop our sanitary appliances, our WC and wash and basin and the shower tray. So click here. The WC we want to copy, we have to group this first. Group. So let's copy now. Drop this somewhere around here. and the shower tray copy that one drop it somewhere around here the wash and basin you rotate first before we copy let's rotate it and we'll copy it into some somewhere around here so i think we are done with that so our dining room let's just copy our dining table there this is our dining table I'll just place that there. So now let's focus on our kitchen. So to do the kitchen now, before we place the kitchen appliances, is sanitary and the cooker here, we have to just do the kitchen cabinet first, where we have the kitchen top before we place the sanitary. So We'll be making that a distance of we'll be making that to have a width of 750 so pick line it's okay draw something of So let's do the fillet command for this. Multiple and the radius, we'll put it as zero.
do the fillet command again multiple radius and this time around we'll give the radius 50 and select this and this select this and this and we are good so we'll trim away this line and we'll come back we'll select we'll do match properties to get the layer of this and we'll select this this So we've taken the kitchen cabinet or the kitchen top to the furniture layer. This is what we just do now is bring in our kitchen zinc and the cooker. So here we can do we'll group this together, group, and we can copy it. And place it somewhere around here. So copy our cooker and place it somewhere around there. So we'll leave the store and the laundry alone and I think we are done populating the ground floor now so this thing we have done now is just to make our drawing come alive this is not an interior design this is not the way the interior design will be done this is just to make the drawing alive to come alive if it is an interior design it will be more detailed than this but to make our drawing come alive that's why we are doing this so we will leave the store and the laundry out of this and at this place now this is where our stair all is in the next video will show us how to go about the staircase